Hello, BookTube, and welcome back to uh, Hours in My Library. This week, uh, we are in London, but we're also in Paris. There's nothing sort of special about the look of this book. It's Nightlife, London and Paris, Past and Present by Ralph Neville. Nothing special. The spine's slightly faded. Or, well, it's probably not been in the sun. It's just age-related. Um, uh, Happens to all of us. It's Castle and Company. And it was published in 1926. Uh, there are eight illustrations. Uh, this is The New Prince's Cabaret, a vivid scene from modern nightlife in London. And it's in black and white. It's the frontispiece. Uh, I don't know much about Ralph Neville. I know he's done a number of books. Uh, and he he's done one uh, history of of clubs london clubs i'd like to i'd like to get uh i've never sort of really looked for it much i just know that he has done it there's what do they call that uh the chat noir looks like an old pub location um and we'll go into the contents of this a little more in a moment and here's a row in gambling hell, oh, a row, sorry, a row in gambling hell, a common occurrence in the nightlife of a century ago. Let's get a little closer there. And yeah, it's it's uh, nightlife, London, uh, and Paris, past and present. He's the author of The Merry Past, Mayfair, and Montemarie, Paris of Today, etc., etc. And uh, the the uh, chapters I've I've read I've read the majority of this, and it's well written. It's it's a fun read. It's London of the Past as chapter, pleasure haunts, and night houses, London in the eighties, the Empire Lounge, Bohemian clubs. The Music Hall and its stars. That's I, I enjoyed that one. Restaurants old and new. Sparks and spend uh, thrifts. Gamblers and gambling. And there's two chapters. There's one and then two. Men of Pleasure. Paris and uh, chapter uh, two chapters on Paris. And it's a it's a thick book, but it's barely three hundred pages. Well, it's a little over three hundred. 310 with uh, with the index and it's it's just a fun fun little read it's, it's I guess it, the reason why I'm showing this is not because it's a beautifully crafted book in any shape or form it's just a solid book uh, but it's the subject matter that is quite interesting and comparing uh, Paris and London uh, you can you can see the differences and similarities uh, between between the both cities uh, for the nightlife and uh, and then it's interesting because it says past and present well the present is in this case is nigh on a hundred years so it's the past and the past for us so that's that's what's great about uh, these old books and uh, yeah so I'm not sure what I'm going to do next week, but uh, that is, it's a very short one, uh, but this is hours in my library, library this time. Take care, BookTube.